Well, what is going on? Welcome back to Clayton Schick Outdoors. Of course, I'm Clayton Schick. This is 100% the glassy lake outdoors. And today's mission is Big Mama Lake Trout. So let's get right into it and start, I think, sharpshooting. We're gonna sharpshoot first. We might troll a little bit later, but let's do some sharpshooting right now. Sharpshooting is probably the plan, I think, for the most part. We might do some trolling, like I said, but we're just gonna go along some, some humps, basically, that are located close to some deep water and try to drop down the big mama tube lake trout from send it outdoors six and a half inch tube it's a it's a big one it's harder to catch the smaller lake trout with this tube i'm not gonna lie oh the bumping as it's falling i'm just gonna stop it i think let's do a slow retrieve and if one picks it up on the way up i'll try to set it oh, they're so hard to catch this big tube we're after the big mamas but the little ones are definitely interested in taking a swipe at it. That's fun. That's a fun little way to start. Just some little guys. But I think we're just gonna keep moving along here and looking. Oh, I should really, really, really get some nets ready because I'm gonna pay for this if I all of a sudden hook a fish. Clayton, you should really have some nets ready. Hopefully we get to use this net. I keep that net for pretty much most of the most of the lake trout and this is if we get like a great great big one when you're fishing by yourself you have to have the net ready if you have a partner well you can keep the net aside the other guy can get the net out but you don't want to be fumbling for the net because you're fighting the big lake trout worst thing that can happen Just a swarm of lake trout. <laughs> oh, they're all little though. Eventually we'll come across a bigger one. These little ones are so hard to keep buttoned. With a big tube, their jaw strength is just so strong. And they can just grab onto that. So what, what I'm talking about is a smaller lake trout. Its jaw strength is so strong. They just clamp down on this bait. And when you set the hook, you're literally just pulling that trout. So if it weighs less than six, seven pounds, you're just pulling that lake trout up as he's clamped on. So how to solve that would be a treble hook, like a stinger hook. You'd catch more for sure. But I'm not worried about landing every single lake trout. The smaller ones, I don't care if they bite, bite a little bit and then get off. I'm perfectly fine with that because we are hunting the bigger ones. I think I'm going to use my trolling motor and just move myself around here slowly. There's some, or there's lots of fish here anyway in this little area that I'm fishing right now. And there's, these ones are smaller. I did see one bigger mark though, for sure. I think this one might actually stay buttoned though. This one I got on. This one is officially hooked. Come here, buddy. Oh, the power of the lake trout. So much fun. Well, one in the boat, not the size we're after, but the right species anyways. Whew, see ya. Trolling motor, let's move around, I think, with the, with the trolling motor. Let's have some fun with that, because it's new. Pretty excited about it too. I think I'm going to maybe even cast for these a little bit. I think I should get my uh, my Acme bait back out. Let's do that. There's fish everywhere here. So many fish. Let's do some casting here. Falling out there at 70 feet. Falling, falling, falling. Okay, hit the bottom. Let's pop it. Let's do a slow retrieve. Not in the best angle for a hook set here. Oh, oh that was wicked. <laughs> Casting for them is pretty fun. I, this would be better if I was in the front of the boat casting for him, but I'll just make do with what I'm doing right here. Very cool. Very cool. Oh, 
Oh, perfect. Thank you. That was perfect. Okay. Well, I think we're gonna do a combination of tube jigs and combination of pitching this swim bait. Eight inch, uh, oh, I forget the name of it. I did a video on it recently. I think it's Octogambo, Octogambo, something like that from Kalen's, I think, with a two ounce uh, S jig. Ultimate S jig, I think it's called. Cool, oh, look at all those fish out there. 70 feet. Bait's falling 70 feet, like perfect, right on. Look at them race to it. Just gonna get it moving right away. That's crazy. <laughs> wow, that's fun. I don't care who you are, how big they are. When you can cast to them like that, that is a riot. I don't think it's that small. I don't think it's huge, but it's not tiny. It's just a nice one. That is cool. Yep, that is fun. Casting for Lakers? Yes, please. Yes, please. What a riot. Okay. Nice fish though. Definitely a nice fish. Biggest one of the evening. And it's gone. Barbless hook right out. Perfect. I should probably net some fish like that, but uh, we'll do it a little bit later in the evening if I can't score anything bigger. Come on, chase it down. Man, that looks like a good fish. Those are wide, wide, uh, like S's when he S down towards the bait. Still messing with it down there. It's gonna be ready for a hook set. Hold up a bit, see if he follows. This looks like wide S's. Oh, he's still here. Yeah, that's a decent fish. For sure. I don't think it's huge, but it's definitely decent. Oh, that one shot right down. I don't know if that's the same one or not. I don't know if that's the same fish or not. I don't think it was, but I still think it's a decent fish though. <laughs> yeah, that's a decent fish. That one's got a little bit more weight to him. Not huge, we're gonna see him right away. I've got him up pretty quick. That's a fun fish right there. Just a fun one. Okay, I'll drag, back off your drag a little bit. Let you burp. <laughs> oh man, that one shot straight down. I'm thinking the other one was probably around that same size. I'm thinking, looks like it'd be like a, 33 inch or something like that. Okay, we'll let you run once, tighten the drag a bit, stop you, and bring you back up. Come to Papa. That was fun, that was lots of fun. I'm sure that was a different fish. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure I saw another one just kind of slide in there. I'm gonna net this one just to see how accurate my measure is right now. Show it off and get it back. Switch to a white tube just because for a little bit. No reason really other than I just wanted to try a white tube. Okay, let's get the net out here. And get you, get you in. Come on, there we go. I might be a little bit bigger than 33, maybe 35. And what do we got here? Oh, my 34 and a half. Yeah, don't quite get to, don't quite easy. Look at it tense. That fish has got so much strength left yet. Get that mouth closed. Like 34 and three quarters. Well, we're still looking for bigger, but that's a nice fish right now. As the sun is setting. Nah, I got about another hour, hour and a half yet of the sunset, before the sun sets. So beautiful, let's get it back in. See ya. Awesome. I was talking about that fish seemed like it was just a little bit bigger on its way down it had fairly like wide s's right like the wider the s obviously the longer the fish is 
like I, and I also said I didn't feel like it was really like great big I just felt like it was a nice one I still don't think that was the one that I caught but I think the other one was probably around that same size-ish oh that's big that's big just waiting to put in reverse right here that looks really nice come on drop down it's dropping it's dropping I think we stayed with it too oh yeah we stayed with it nice stayed with it nice oh yeah and that mark's coming that fish is coming right to it come on buddy come on grab right at the bottom come on that's a nice fish come on it ate it it ate it that's a big fish i think come on oh no i dropped him he's coming again though he's coming again he's coming again come on that's a nice fish oh no way He'll chase it back down. Yeah, he's chasing it down. He ate it on the way down. Oh, he bumped it. Get back down there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Eat it on the bottom, buddy. Pick it up. Pick it up. Oh, come on. Give me another chance. Give me another chance. I can't believe I dropped him. Come on. Oh, he just hardly touched it. Come on, where are you? He's right here with it. Chase it up, maybe? Come on. No, I think he wants to eat it down low. Probably a better chance. Okay, come on. Pick it up. Bumped it. He's oh no, that time. Come on. Oh no, there's another one that came in there. Oh, the other one looks big too. Oh, this one grabbed it. This one grabbed it. Come on. Stay button this time. Stay button. The other one looked nice too. Come on, baby. Where are you? Where are you? That's just a nice one. Oh yeah. That's wicked. Bigger than the last one. There she goes. Oh yeah. Oh baby. Love big lake trout love them one thing i can say is they seem to really like glass calm weather oh come on baby it's not great great big that other one looked a little bit bigger i'm pretty sure this is the one i was messing with originally oh yeah clay don't write it right to your real tip that's a nice fish that's a nice fish okay come on we're just gonna get you in the net with a lot of strength i like trying to get them in the net early get our net ready oh that is a strong fish holy the power of the lake trout huge huge fan of this rod rod seven foot nine mag heavy elliot moderate fast action rod it's awesome love it okay come here look at him in the water it's so cool it's like a 37 ish maybe 38 Come here, a young fish, small head. Oh, bad net job, we got her. We got her, awesome. Quick measure, thinking 36-ish, 37. Jeez, just fatter, 35 and a half. Oh, <laughs> it's way fatter than the first one. Awesome. Oh, she's burping, that's a good thing right there. 35 and a half inches, but chunky monkey, love it. Nice and healthy, going back. Oh. She has a pile of strength left. See ya. Sharp shooting Lakers could be one of the things I enjoy more than anything else. It's just that, that like hand-to-hand -hand fight, close contact, it's so much fun. Recently, I did a video with my top five tips, sharp shooting for lake trout, and didn't catch any big fish in it. Fished for like eight, 10 hours, it was tough. Right now, I've been fishing for a couple, well, an hour-ish, maybe I was gonna say a couple hours, maybe it's only an hour-ish so far, I've got two good quality fish i guess i'll show you it's like no matter how good of the area you know or how how good you know the area where the big fish are if they're not biting they're not biting it's just the way it is you can almost never get them to go when they're grumpy lake trout are so fragile in that sense where it's like when they're off they're off but when they're on it's a riot i know i need to make like a trolling video too for lakers at some point which i i will i just it's so hard to give up the 
jigging for him because it's just something I love to do so much. say oh yeah that's a big fish that's a big fish come on follow me down yeah follow me down oh no come on give me another chance buddy there's two of them there I think Another chance. Oh, come on. One of them looked big, bigger. Oh, come on, buddy. Here comes another one racing in. That one I can't tell for size, though. It slacked me. I need that one that's further away. I need that one that's like 50 feet away here, 55 feet away. Cast it right by it. Come on, it's falling. Oh, it went right to it, come on. I'm just gonna pop it back. If I get slammed out there, I'm gonna have to just reel down and set it hard. I think he picked it up. Picked, oh no, no way. I'm sure that was it. Am I gonna get another chance? It ate it again. It ate it again. Come on, stay button, baby. Gotta get a hook set, set, set on him. I still don't think I got a good hook set on him. Oh, it's not the big one that I saw. It's not the big one. Oh man, it's a nice fish, but it's definitely not the one I saw. <laughs> that was cool though. Hopefully I get another chance. That's still not a bad fish for uh, casting out there. That's cool. Easy, easy, easy. I'll net you, show you off, get you back. That was cool. Okay, just a nice 33 incher. Not big, but not bad. It's been a good evening of lower to mid 30s. See ya. It's so cool. Well, with that fish, that will wrap up this video. The Stended Outdoors White Big Mama Tube was the one I went to in the, in the end. I did fish, like I said, for a little bit. I casted it that, uh, Kalen's uh, swim bait here. It's a ultimate swim bait jig with an eight inch octo gamble. Don't quote me on that. I know I pronounced it right in my last video or in a video I've done previously, but yeah, a little bit of sharp shooting, a little bit of casting, some nice size Lakers. We're only going up. Hopefully I can still catch a big mama lake trout in open water videos yet this year, but the last couple were how to sharpshoot for them. And now another sharpshooting video that had a little bit more success in terms of some larger size, but thank you so much for watching and don't forget, get outside.